So you probably think you're experts on how to tie your shoes. I mean, it's like you've known it since you were like four. However, most of you are still doing it wrong, even after seeing that video. Let's start with doing an experiment. Everybody untie your shoelaces. If you don't have laces, you can use your neighbors. Start by tying the overhand knot so that you're prepared to do the bow. So your shoes should look like this. On the screen, there's a timer. When I say go, start to tie your shoes. When you finish, check up and see how long it took you. Ready, set, go. Shout out how long it took you. 2.8. 2.8. What? Three seconds. 2.3. So this is how I tie my shoes. So as you can see, unless you use a method similar to mine, mine is probably going to be faster. When I did an unscientific experiment with my family, this way of tying your shoes was about 50% faster than anybody else's. How instead of telling you all about it, I'm going to show you by teaching Mark how to tie his shoes. Give him a round of applause as he comes to stage. <laughs> okay, so begin by tying the overhand knot. Now you're going to grab the left string with your pinky, like this. Mm -hmm. Pinch your thumb and your forefinger together and loop it under the shoelace and spread your fingers apart. So it'll create a zigzag shape. Now the right shoelace, you're also going to grab with your pinky. How this time instead of going under, you're going to go over the shoelace, yes, and spread them apart. So you see it creates a zigzag shape between laces. Now you're going to twist both shoelaces, yes, just like that, so that when they cross they create an X. You're going to pinch the lace here and the lace here running across your fingers, pinch both of them and pull. Okay, one more time, yeah. So grab the left shoelace with your pinky, pinch your thumb and forefinger together, Loop it under the shoelace, spread your fingers apart. Right one, pinky, over this time, spread them apart, twist. Once you got it, twist. Yeah, pinch them, pull. <laughs> now you truly are experts on how to tie your shoes. You know a way that in a year will save you 12 whole minutes. <laughs> Out of 10 years, it'll save you two hours. And in 100 years, you would spend a whole day being able to do something more substantial than tying your shoes. <laughs>